Hey, welcome to the Shoulder Saver video. My name is Alex. I'm going to show you two of my favorite exercises to keep your shoulders healthy, strong, and resilient. Um, like anybody else, I've had shoulder issues, aches, discomfort, things like that. A lot of this comes from when we stick with only a few exercises that don't work all the functions of the shoulder. The shoulder is very delicate, uh, it's very mobile, so it needs to be strong in a lot of different angles. So my two favorite exercises that, bar none, make my shoulders feel better every single time I do them consistently are the following. Number one is shoulder external rotation. You need a very light weight. This is only four kilos. And you can start even lighter than that. Uh, what I do is I get into this sort of pose like that. This is the starting position. You want to keep a big chest, all right? Uh, and just for reference, what I usually do is I have this arm, the arm that's going to be working, behind this shoulder here. So they're not squared off. I just find that this helps me to keep the position a lot better, make sure that I'm keeping this shoulder pulled back. What you don't want is you don't want this shoulder hanging forward like this. You don't want to be slumped. You want to have a big chest, and you want to have your shoulder pulled back as much as you can, as if you're trying to get your shoulder blades to touch each other. So what you're going to do with the weight, you're going to simply come up like so, and go down slowly. Now, depending on your shoulder mobility, you can go down very far, again, as long as this doesn't happen, because that's going to end up causing you some issues. Or you can go down as far as you can control, let's say it's about here, and just stick with this range of motion. And you want to, again, maintain this tall posture, like so. Come up, hang out there for a second, and come down. Usually I'll do about uh, two seconds on the way up, four seconds on the way down. I learned this from Liav at uh, Ido Portalm at the gym in Tel Aviv, and uh, it's been a very, very good way to make sure you do the reps slowly and uh, really get the most out of each and every rep. The second one is, uh, they're called YTWs and Ls. So what you're going to do is, I'll show you the position here, then I'm going to show you how you do them on the ground. You've got your hands like this in a Y, here's a T, a W, an L. And again, you want to make sure that you're pulling your shoulder blades back as much as possible. There's really no benefit to be had from being here for this exercise. This helps strengthen a lot of the muscles in between the shoulder blades, which uh, just kind of like the bastard child of uh, everyday training for most people, since we all know that they exist, we don't really care to train them, but it ends up coming back to bite you in the end. So, easiest way to start doing these is on the ground. You want to have your forehand or your chin on the ground. Hang on. Y. T, W, and L. It's really as simple as that. Uh, do as many reps as you can with good form. When your form starts to slow down, or you start to shake on either of these exercises, you can consider your set done. Even one set like that a day is going to have a huge impact on how your shoulders feel. So try those out. Let me know what you think. And of course, if you like the video, be sure to share and subscribe.